Hi, what you're gonna see today is how you can make your own wall clock. For you to make your own do-it-yourself clock, what you primarily need is the clock assembly or the clock mechanism. You can walk into any of your local clock store and ask for the clock assembly and it will not cost you more than 100 rupees. This is how the clock mechanism looks. Now in the front, it has a projection which is nothing but the rotating clock movement. In the bottom is uh, the hours movement, in the middle is the minutes movement and what you have on the top is the slot for the seconds movement. Along with the clock assembly, make sure you also get this small screw which helps you secure the mechanism in place on the clock face. In the rear, what you have is the clock control with which you set the time for the clock and also the slot for the battery. Now what is missing in this whole thing is obviously the clock hands. So you also need to separately ask for the hands. So what you have is the hours hand, minutes hand and the seconds hand. Now we will see how each of these hands will fit into their corresponding moments. I said uh, the bottom rotating movement is for the hours. So the hours hand goes in first. What goes in second is the minutes hand. All you need to do is gently place it in its slot and, and slightly press it so that it sits comfortably on the slot. What eventually goes in is the seconds hand. Since the battery is on the clock works right away and what you have is a working clock assembly. The next step is to see how this assembly will fit into the clock face that you are making. You can use a variety of things for the clock face. What I'm going to show you is some of the things that I think can be used as clock face. For example, this is one side T which I use for most of my projects. This is a plain cardboard sheet. You can use it as a clock face. This is a simple white laminate. This can also be used as a clock face. If you are into glass painting and you can figure out how you can drill a hole in the middle of glass, you can also use glass. Besides this, you can use uh, chart paper, you can use handmade paper, pretty much anything that is sturdy but make sure the thickness of uh, uh, the material that you use is not beyond 6 millimeter because that's the size of the projection that is there on the clock mechanism. For the purpose of demonstration, I'm going to use a small piece of cardboard as the clock face. What you need is a hole in the center which is uh, as wide as uh, the protrusion itself. Now the thickness of the clock face cannot be more than the depth or the height of the protrusion. Insert the clock mechanism through the rear of the clock face. Now once inserted, Secure it with the screw that is available. Now insert the clock hands. The R goes first, followed by the minutes hand, and then by the seconds hand. Now, this is a simple wall clock. Now, if you understand the logic behind how this wall clock was made. You can extend it to just about any wall clock that you want to make irrespective of the material you use for the clock face. Hope the time you spend watching this video is purposeful. Do remember to join us in www.facebook.com slash We'll see you soon with another video tutorial. Thank you.